What is going on everybody and welcome back to the channel with me Mrs. Z1. We are checking out Immortal Life. It looks like a super fun game. Kind of reminds me of Stardew Valley kind of with like more of I don't know like an anime kind of feel. Um, let's go ahead. Let's hop on in new game create a character. I'm gonna go ahead and create our character and um, yeah, we'll get on into it. Okay, so there is no cus no customization for your character. Um, all you had to do is type in your name and your last name. Genuine member. Please wait a moment, my friend. What brings you to the genuine sect? Give Elder Zo tokens to him. Ah, so you are Z Mrs. So it's asked me what my last name was, and I put Z, and then it put asked me what my first name was, and I put Mrs. And I think it's all messed up, so that's why it looks like that. We don't we don't need to worry about it. Wonderful Elder Zo ordered me to come and welcome you, and so I've been waiting here for some time. The Misty Valley is a preposterous place with abundant resources. Unfortunately, our sect has ever focused on swordsmanship and a few of us know anything about gardening, let alone farming. So the land has long since gone follow. At the moment, Elder Zo is at the main peak discussing matters with others. He asked me to give you this special talisman for the Misty Valley on your arrival and intend to take you and intended to take you there himself later. There are a lot of people ahead. What's going on? They're recruiting new members. They are all wandering cultivators who have come to take the entrance examination. We're quite strict, uh, so only one or two out of the ten will ever be selected. However, as you were personally selected by Elder Zo, you needn't take part in the examination. Thank goodness. Please wait with them in front of the main hall for now while I report to my supervisor. Okay, so it looks like just basic commands in order to move. Move to the front of the main hall and wait with the others. Oh, what the heck? She like disappeared in like brightness. This main hall is really magnificent. And just think this is only the reception area of the outer sect. I heard the buildings at the inner sect are even grander. Will the requirements be very high? Things will happen as they happen. We just need to do our best and nature will take its course. Ah, uh, hello. Are you here to join the genuine sect too? You look so calm and relaxed. You seem to be very sure you can pass the examination. Aren't you at all nervous? Oh, sorry, lady. I don't even have to do it. Ah, uh, well, you sound very confident. Good luck with the examination. Uh, what is it? What is that in the sky? What? What's in the sky? Chi 几道奇异的光芒他冲到这位遍体鳞上昏迷不醒的归云派弟子身旁面露焦急之色。This, what is happening? Brother Zai, what happened to you? What's going on? Brother, brother! Don't panic, I have to stay calm and think. Right, that's it. I am Yang the Quinn, and it's our priority to save him now. Please fetch the doctor. At once, uh, Dr. Sun lives in the western side of town. I will send brother 
to the Sunset Inn first. Please ask Dr. Sh Dr. Sun to come and save him as soon as possible. You want to save the game? Yes, let's save the game. Okay, oh my gosh. Craziness is upon us. We need to do stuff. We need to go. It should be safe here. Okay, I don't think I need to talk to any of these people. Okay, we need to go find the doctor. Okay, we are right here. Um, it said in the west, Dr. Sun. I don't even see Dr. Sun. I don't even know where to go. Send for Dr. Sud. Send for Dr. Sun. Uh, talk? No. Can I jump over this stuff? No, that way is blocked. Oh, darn. Okay, we can't go this way. <gasps> Dr. Sun, we found you. Oh, my gosh. This was such a horrific sound. Could something have happened to the sect? What on... Uh, you look to be in a hurry. What can I do for you? Explain the situation. Uh, we must hurry. If we're going to save him, I'll pack the first aid kit and we're leaving for the inn this minute. You didn't have to travel very far for Dr. Sun. Um, you are worried about the sect member. Go to the inn and have a look. Where is the inn? I'm going to guess this is the inn. Yes. Did you get a room for the injured cultivator from the sect? Well... He's now in the room on the leftmost side of the second floor. I saw Dr. Sun entering his room. What do you think happened to the sect? I don't know. The town is a mess right now. Okay. Upstairs. To the left. Dr. Sun, how is he? I think at the critical moment, he used all his power to repair what he could of his body, which saved his life. I've done an emergency treatment on him, but his wounds are deep and severe. I'm afraid it could take him half a month or so to regain consciousness, if not longer. At very least, he is still alive. I hope brother will pull through. The spiritual power on the mountain is running wild. No one here is strong enough to approach it until it calms. Once it settles, I want to go up and see what's become of the sect. It's gone, everything, everyone. I was once told by the elder brothers of the inner sect that most of the buildings of the Jinyan sect were located on the mountain to the north. I went to the edge of the cliffs and there was nothing left. It was all raised to the ground. How could anyone have survived? Brothers in a coma and may not awaken for some time to come and all others are dead. I'm sorry for your loss. What will you do now? What will I? Oh, he's crying. In truth, I'm not a member of the sect. I am just another wandering cultivator who has been working hard to be worthy of joining them. Yet, never once did they treat me as an outsider. They've always encouraged me to continue my training. And now the disaster has come down on them by some good fortune. Brother narrowly es escaped and was saved by us. Okay, so I'm just going to continue going on. I feel like this is, has a huge, long story. And um, I'm just going to see where it takes us in to start playing some gameplay. Misty Valley. Oh my gosh, this looks so cool. So it looks like we talked to some other people. And um, now we're finally getting into the game. I'm so excited. Okay, so we were given an axe. We need to cut trees to gather lumber. Um, One. Did I equip it? Okay, what the heck is that? Need a hoe. I don't have a hoe. I'm not able to do that yet. Okay, so now we need to fix up this house. How do we do that? Oh, I need to bring him the wood. Okay, so now we have a house. Um... So it looks like we're going to get a hoe now. Okay, awesome. Number two, let's use the hoe. Uh, till. So what happens if we... Oh, you can't till the same area. Okay, so it said something about you have to clean up the oh. weeds first. Oh, depending on how we answer things, it ups our stamina, our health. Uh, <laughs> I'm going to do stamina. Okay, and we were given nine wheat seeds. We already know what we're gonna do with those. We gotta plant those suckers. Okay, so we have to open our inventory and then drag them to the quick bar. Okay, I was trying to figure out how in the world we were gonna figure this out. Okay, Q. 
Now we are able to plant. Got it. I didn't know how I was able to access our wheat seeds. Okay, now we got a watering gourd. Um, I was trying to go to the water because I thought I might have to fill it up, but I guess I don't have to fill it, fill it up. Press and hold E to summon a thundercloud. What? Oh my gosh, that is so cool. Okay, so we got a harvest talisman. Um, use a harvest talisman and bring the wheat. Okay. Okay, we're gonna have to equip this guy. Oh my gosh, this is cool. There's like magic stuff. Oh, I'm digging it. Okay, so we gave her the 10 wheat and she gave us two harvest talismans. Um, I wonder if we just wait if it'll you know, mature on its own, I would assume so. Okay, so it looks like we're kind of just having a meetup by the fire. I'm talking to a bunch of people and I'm getting a bunch of quests, so... Um, I do not have spiritual spirit shards yet. We go home. That is our home. Oh, our friends were at our house. I didn't even realize that. Um, okay, sleeping restores your stamina. You will get up to get up at seven o'clock in the next morning. Put decorations in your house in your house. Help restore you better when you rest. Okay, sounds good. Call it a day. Okay, we're back up. It looks like today we need to get some more of those spirit shards, and we're supposed to meet somebody by the lake. Okay, so we got some bok choy seeds and some potato seeds. Okay, I kind of wanna wanna figure out what the heck this is. A bamboo shoot! Ah! Okay. Okay, let's see. What is that? Oh, save. Okay, so that's just a saving thing. Um, I don't know where I planted that stuff. <gasps> right here. Okay, down from our house. Okay, it looks like we when we also harvested the wheat, we got different levels. We got a B, a C, and an A. I'm sure that'll come into play later on. Bamboo shoot. I don't know how we do that thing. It's, oh, it was E. Hold down E. Summon the thunderstorm. Darn, that only got one. You know, I wasn't even paying attention to the top left. All of that probably should. We have stamina, mana, health. Okay, so everything's planted. If I use our harvest talisman, will it get all of this stuff? Okay, so let's bring the bok choy and the potato. We got a green jade ring. Right click to use it. Oh, did it give us more slots? Okay. Okay, now we need to meet someone by the lake and we need to give spirit shards. How do we get spirit shards? I have no idea. Was that a spirit shard? I'm thinking so. Okay, oh, we got a fishing rod. Now we can go fishing. Oh, we caught nothing. I pulled it up when it started biting. Maybe I need to wait a little bit longer. Oh, I think we got something. Oh, we need to catch a big head carp and talk to... Okay. We need to keep on fishing. Okay, we caught a big head carp. We need to go to the inn. Home... I think we need to go up the up here. Okay, we're blocked. <laughs> we need a good pickaxe in order to get over there. I guess we are not going to the sect. Let's see, to the fairy shop, the sunset forest. Maybe it's to sunset forest? No, we need a good axe for that. Oh, darn it. Also, it looks like there's a bridge right there and it's broken. I wonder if we go up there. I wonder if it tells us how to fix it. Okay, fairy shop. <gasps> this is where we need to go. That's where the inn is. Okay, so I think we just agreed to clean up something. Okay, so we need to clean up the docks. I kind of like the fact that you're able to have uh, multiple quests show up on the screen at the same time. Um... I hate not being able to have that. Just because I feel like you can do multiple quests at the same exact time. And 
if they're not all listed right there, I kind of tend to forget about the other one. <gasps> Are we gonna learn to cook? I'm pretty excited. This is where you start cooking. The first thing you'll do is get the ingredients. After that, take them to the appropriate table for processing. The one on the left is the cutting board for vegetables and the one on the right. The dishes require ingredients to be mixed or kneaded. You can get water directly from the basin in the middle of the kitchen. Once all the ingredients have been prepared, put them in the boiling pot, steamer, or wok to cook or per the instructions of the... Oh my gosh, it's moving so fast. Finally, bring the dishes to the serving table. Got it. If it's wrong, we need to put it in the trash can. The quicker you work, the higher your rating. Practice more to become familiar with the various steps. Also, I realize all the characters that we're talking to have some like hearts next to their name. And I wonder as we do stuff with them, as we talk to them more, maybe our friendship uh, level will increase as well. Okay, so we're looking to make a braised silver carp. Okay, wrong ingredients. Veggie cutting board, trash can, sink, empty work top, cutting board boiling pot steamer wok kneading table mixing table serving table okay so it looks like we need to take the fish we need to chop it up then we need to put some sauce on the fish and serve it maybe three two oh my gosh fish choppity chop chop let's do it awesome um let's get some of this Apparently we can't do that there. Let's put it on there. Take the fish. Maybe put, oh, 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 oh. The fish goes in there with the sauce. And then stir fry. You know, I'm not 100% sure I did that correctly, but we'll see. <laughs> I mean, that kind of looks like a walk, right? Okay, it looks, it looks right. It looks like the picture. Perfect. <gasps> okay, so now we need to make steamed buns, scrambled eggs, and tomatoes. Okay, we got this. Steamed buns, scrambled eggs with tomatoes. We can do it. Okay, steamed buns. We need to take this. And I think this is the kneading station. And we need... Oh gosh, what the heck? Oh, it's water? Uh, where did I get the water from? Where do you get the water from? How do I get water? Oh, water's right here. Got it. I thought I had to find like the bowl or something like that to put the water. <gasps> oh my gosh. Okay, there we go. Knead it. Okay, we're gonna take it and we're gonna put it into the steamer. Okay, let's serve it, let's serve it. Okay, scrambled eggs, eggs. I need to cook it in the wok. And then we gotta chop up some tomatoes. Um, chop up the tomatoes. Oh, we lost a star. Okay, take the tomatoes. All because it took us so long to find the stupid water. Wow, I guess I didn't realize how uh, long it was taking me to find that water. <laughs> Should have paid more attention. Normal. Darn. Okay, so we finished that quest. We got six lunch boxes, a braised silver carp, steamed buns, and scrambled eggs with tomatoes. And yes, let's save the game. Oh my gosh, we gotta like deliver a whole bunch of stuff. Okay, let's head down to the docks. Let's clean up some rubble. <gasps> Can we not? I don't have a pickaxe. Hmm, who is gonna give us a pickaxe? I wonder. Okay, it's actually starting to get dark, so let's head on back to our house for now. And you know what? That's actually going to end it for today's episode. Thank you guys so much for coming out and, and watching. I hope you guys did enjoy. I know this is kind of a shorter episode, um, but I kind of just wanted to showcase this game. It looks pretty fun. It looks to be pretty fun. Uh, the beginning story, Spring Rainwater. Um, the beginning story was kind of long, in my opinion, longer than I like. Um, oh, it's raining. 
Man, I wonder, I wish I had some more seeds, because then I probably wouldn't have to water them. Darn it. Um, well, anyways, as I was saying, um, I wanted to show off a little bit about the game. Um, some of the mechanics... Some of the things you'll be doing in the game, such as like cooking and um, farming, harvesting, you know, all that kind of stuff. I think the game has a lot of potential. I am excited to continue checking this out. If you want to see some more on the channel, let me know. If you guys want to see some more on the channel, let me know. We may or may not come back to this. I'm not sure. Um, but thank you guys once again, and I'll see you guys all in the next episode. Bye, everybody.